Ever wonder why a new appointment to the Supreme Court is such big news? Well, of the three branches that make up the federal government, it's arguably the judiciary, the court system, that has the greatest impact upon our lives. But it's the Supreme Court, the highest court in the land, that often makes the decisions that affect us on a national level. Because one of its jobs is to interpret the Constitution. It stepped into this role in 1803, when under Chief Justice John Marshall, it adopted judicial review, the ability to strike down laws that it deemed unconstitutional. But some of its rulings were hugely controversial. The verdict in the Dred Scott case was that the Constitution didn't recognize African Americans as citizens in the first place, and therefore, they had no legal rights. This helped fuel the country's descent into civil war. Following the war and the passing of the 13th, 14th, and 15th Amendments, the Supreme Court was given new powers to prevent state governments from passing laws that violated the rights of individuals. And during the Civil Rights era, the Supreme Court used this power to strike down state laws that they thought went against a person's constitutional rights. It continues to do so today, making landmark rulings that affect all of our lives. Which is why we now have nine justices, an odd number, to prevent deadlock and ensure decisions yes. are made. So, why does it matter? By having the final say on what laws are constitutional and what laws aren't, the Supreme Court has the power to decide what the government can and cannot do. Why do you think Supreme Court decisions create such emotional responses in American citizens? 